it has never been easy for forest traders. It has never been easy for them trying to make profit, investing in forest trading, only for them to realize that their money is not yet to be found. It has never been easy for them seeing a family man investing dollars, believing that from there he can pick up, only for him to discover that his thousand dollars is not yet to be found and uh, nobody uh, to give account of how the money vanished only that his aim was to raise the one thousand dollar to two thousand from there become a rich man a millionaire but lo and behold everything is gone so and why are we here on youtube we are here on youtube because we are some of us have successfully traded and uh, Instead of us to keep it to ourselves, we decided to give it out personally. That is one of the reasons why I'm here, and that is why I also cry to some people to look for a mentor because the dreams you wish to have may never come to pass. I don't wish to insult you, but just notice that the dream you wish to have may never come to pass. Why? Because you are missing some things up. Now, in my previous video, I tried to explain to us one of the simple secrets of how you can do a scalping at least deck like three candles uh, or five candles and be able to cash out and uh, make a little profit out of something. Uh, and uh, so far, so good. Many people are coming out with a positive response. So, in this video, I decided to show you how you can cut spike on boom 1000 and boom crash 500 any boom at all any of the crash indices please um don't use this method on v um, v any of the v's like uh, v75 v25 v10 v100 don't use this method on it or don't even use it on step index please because what i'm about to show you is something that i have tested and I'm sure that it works for crash and one of the major place I use this is for my crash 1000 and boom 1000 boom 500 and boom crash 500 so I don't frequently use it on crash 300 or boom 300 so where I use this and relax is on boom 1000 and boom 500 now look at this um i just want to show you this so that you can use it to catch spike and i will be doing a random um, I will, I will, i'll be showing you everything here randomly because i'll be showing you when you can you may possibly see um skyping and also see your catching spike opportunity but this video is dedicated majorly for those who love to catch spikes and few of those who want to do skyping so let me just show you this and rush to show you the indicators immediately all right now look at this look at this the one minute here is uh, the, the minute here is one minute time frame and this is five minutes time frame now but before that let me show you one simple secret you must know about this strategy now let me show you this let me show you this for you to some of the things you should look out for so that you will know that something is going to drop one look at this every market looks like a mountain every market looks like a mountain every market looks like a mountain This is how the market looks like. When the market want to reverse, it will start going like this. It will start going like this. This is how the market will keep going down. Are you seeing it? This is the functions of the market. Then at a point, the market will start moving to this direction. And as it's going to this direction, which simply means that the market is consolidating or the market is ranging. From this axis now we can say that the market is on downtrend. 
so while on this place if you know thread very well you know that this thing is just like a continuation because it came from somewhere here i get what i'm saying so in such a structure in such a market like this one of the best thing you should know is that if you are trading for skyping your entry point your attention your everything should be on a breakout so this very thing you are seeing on the screen here so one of the things i want you to know is that when you want to do a skyping and you see something that want to start reverse you are seeing the nature of the market like this and you want to do skyping like this nature like what you are seeing here now you want to do skyping it may be wrong because as this thing has curved like this it may continue to go down so what you need to do and what you need to know about these things is that every market has a face so you don't need to trade when even the market is pointing downward so that is one thing you need to know so be serious about it so you know it but let me show you some of the things you need to see in this market number one is this watch every time for those who want to cast spike watch every time the candle crosses the upper bound which is the upper bound is this very thing here the upper bound is this one this is the upper bound this is the lower bound so anytime the candle crosses above the upper door bound and spike down don't enter to cast spike relax but at the center like this as you are seeing this this is exactly what i said earlier you want to cast spike and you see something like this and you see a spike and you enter for a spike it's wrong because even if the, the trail lines even the trail bollinger band and even the moving average the thing is above them and since the thing is above them it's still showing you that the market is in uptrend i mean the bullish movement is strong even though that this is a lower time frame all right that is a lower time frame so but to watch each time the market spike as this thing is may count as many candles as they want it's none of your business but as long as the market spike like this and enter below the lower band the upper band like this if it spike in that manner then sometimes it may spike again like as it happens like here now if it didn't spike again know it that the market is still because all this as is is uptrend all this as is is a bullish movement in crash then the opposite like this is selling movement so you have to know these very things these are simple simple things that you should have in mind so immediately this market is like this and spike and cross this line know it that you have a possibility even when this thing is spiking you will see that the market will start curving down like this showing you that something more is still going to drop except it's going to happen on a continuation but it has never happened let's back test a little and see watch here it, it touches here and they drop here watch here again it touches here and the everything reverse and it drop to this place watch here then you do then the same reverse is the same case watch here too it drops here and drop here as it drops below and the movement and cross all those things the respond again is this this is for skyping so the the thing is the thing is viva so look at it look at it can you see it can you see it so remember that this is a little consolidation so how do you confirm that it may continue look at this everything is going to point down then be careful when it is coming to go up so that you will not be waiting for it to spike down only for you to notice that it has continued in that direction that is how simple this thing can be look at it look at it look at it this is how simple it can be you can do this using your one minute time frame look at this one here look at this one look at this one too can you see it can you see it so look at it i'm just talking about those who are using small account then for you that want to trade confidently with your higher time frame 
how do you do this it is almost the same thing let's assume let's just visit like one hour time frame in your one hour time frame we'll have something like this now look at it all these things happened like this these things are skyping all those things are skyping now while it is skyping is still dropping is skyping is still dropping but when did it become a spike zone it is when it spike and cross to this area so your major target should not be this small small movement here your major target should be that it has spiked and crossed this line and cross this one that should be your major target so where should you be doing your tp if you are doing if you are catching spike here now this is where you should be entering your trade because this is your this is your, your support zone and here is your resistance zone let me make it clear so that for those who are doing skyping now here now is your support zone and this place is your resistance zone so if you are talking about tp now if you are talking about tp here now should be your tp here now should be your sl your stop loss here now should be your stop loss in case and your tp should be two times of your stop loss which is this place here now one and this place here two and here should be your tp are you getting it too your first tp should be here and your second tp should why here because of this so that if you check it like this it's a mantle here and the last one should be somewhere here so that is how it works so if you follow these simple simple strategies you can catch spike and make a huge profit and nobody will say that some people are seeing forest trading as a crime some are seeing it as a impossible to something some are even thinking that some of us who are i mean somebody some, some some somebody said to me that you don't trade and i was just like i was laughing i was laughing maybe because and that is why some people will charge for these strategies because if you drop it free some will come back to you and say uh, like somebody said how can i subscribe to your channel when they, and i was just laughing go and ask the early people that started this thing they all of them were they were making losses because there were no simple guide like this there were no simple guide like this so you should be thankful that you can see people who can at least be honest with you believe me if you have the knowledge of trading almost every strategy in these videos work not not only gdfs videos every strategies almost all of them will work the major targets and the major i mean the major challenge we are having is that we'll have people who watch only videos without greater knowledge of what they need that is the major issue here so a lot of people want to trade and make profit without proper guidance so and the one simple mistake they have made in their life is that they dumble into too many videos they dumble into too many strategies they dumble into so many right that is at the end of the day end up confusing themselves so they open this one's video and this one says something in a different way they apply it in the next two hours they open another person and this person is coming from another angle they apply it let me tell you the truth friends if you want to succeed in forest trading get one person i'm not saying that you must pay the person to teach you i must pay in that much so even if you want to watch a video even if it is not gdfs video stick to one person pattern stick to one person's pattern follow that person squarely even if you want to visit another person's video or another person's strategy get the knowledge and apply it to the one you have don't outrightly drop what you have to start afresh with a new idea it's good if that person is not feeding you well you have the opportunity to learn something new but the problem is that some don't even have any knowledge at all the only thing they do is as i upload this video now they will just watch it let's assume that they had a little knowledge about the other person they said ah this person is telling us about a uh, bologna band why what we are learning last time was the uh, rosi for that reason you removed everything you know about bologna band and uh, rosi and focus on bologna band it's not true but the real deal is this the knowledge you have on rsi 
can help you and support you to trade Colonia Band successfully, even moving averages. That is how the team works. So let me show you the indicator so that I will not forget it because a lot of people have seen me as somebody who doesn't drop a uh, indicators. I want to prove them wrong that I don't do those things intentionally. You know, we talk too much. So that is it. So, all right, this is moving average 200. And I also promise that this very little thing, I will also drop it and uh, the the android version of it okay so this is 200 so please for those who doesn't see it maybe because of the size of the screen they are using or this thing is fancy please hear it in, in audio the moving average i'm using is moving average 200 method linear weighted method linear weighted believe me if you know about forest trading just hearing it alone can help you fit in the team now the Bollinger band i am using the period is 50 not 500 of the other one the period is 50. some who doesn't know let me show you what it means if you add 500 watch the upper band watch these things watch these two lines now watch what is going to happen can you see it is becoming bigger it's becoming bigger so they are doing different job are you seeing it they are doing different job so i just want you to use this so that it can help you to trade it i just want you to use this one okay i just want you to use this one so so that you can trade with it it can also help you but just trade with 50 for skyping so that anytime you see the reversal is going to help you so that it will not confuse you so what are you trading now the sorry the deviation is still the same 1.165 apply to close use any color of your choice that is how simple this strategy can be so what are you looking at for anytime you see a cross like this so now see this thing somebody sent me a message and that is just the simple truth the comments should be on my comment section on my previous videos now listen if you want to do well in skyping or in catching spike mostly in this video that you are seeing here now the thing is very simple look at this thing as you just see this thing now if this thing can cross this in a higher time frame watch these arrows watch these arrows watch them what what i see they all have curved and as they have curved you have something here and this is where it's dropping you as simple as that look at the 200 moving average it has crossed it immediately it crossed it it's showing you that something is going to drop for skyping as simple as that then let's look at it the same way in our in our this thing for skyping for for skyping too look at this thing here look at this thing as this thing cross this thing you have this thing you have this thing here watch look at watch here watch here it has breaking out from here you also do this thing and watch the moving average the moving average is below and watch this one is pointing the same direction up that is how simple this market can be you just use these simple indicators to guide yourself and before you know you have achieved your goal so don't bother trading this area don't bother trading below this area if you are not convertant remember, remember what i told you on our, on our last video so if you are not this thing so if you don't have cap bit capital you can trade inside like i showed you last time you can trade this little thing before you to get to this place to decide whether it will reverse or not you are out of the market always remember that that is a phase so the, once the market is facing upward what you now used to do what you now what you need now is for you to relax and see if the upward movement will continue if it will continue it's an advantage for you everybody can do this so please try this on your demo and be serious with it because if you're not serious with demo you cannot be serious in life trade so that is how it is I want to sign out here because my name is JDFX and I love you so much. I want to hear you. I want to see you succeed. Thank you, JDFX, signing out.